This young man lives in the French territory of Mayotte, off the coast of Africa. He is under the effects of a synthetic form of cannabis that's known locally as chimique or chemical. Ali Mohamed Yusuf is a doctor at Mayotte's main addiction center. He sees a lot of chimique. Chimique is a new product. It's a designer drug, a synthetic version of cannabis that's taken the place of the real thing. It can either put someone into a stupor like a zombie, or it can remove their self-control, make them agitated and aggressive. Mayotte became a full French department in 2011. As part of bringing it in line with the rest of France, the authorities installed high-speed internet access, and that made it easier for dealers to get their hands on the synthetic drug. It's sold online legally because it hasn't yet been added to lists of banned substances. Users don't even know what they're taking. The drug comes as a white powder. The dealers dilute it using alcohol or another solvent. They then mix it with herbs or tobacco or something else. They dry the mixture, then package it in small quantities that they sell for 50 or 100 times as much as they paid. Dr. Yusuf says one in five of the patients he sees come in because of Shimik, and that most of them come from the territory's large population of unemployed young men under the age of 25. We see young patients ranging from 13 to 26 years old. The youngest we've seen was just nine years old. He'd started using the drug when he was eight. People who are addicted to chimique suffer horribly. It brings nothing but unhappiness and can cause major health problems.